Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Nicole here. Today I am back with a Shein haul. Um, it's been a couple of years since I last placed an order with Shein, I think like three years ago. Um, I actually posted that video onto YouTube, so if you guys wanna watch it, I'll go ahead and link it. Um, it's been a couple of years again, so I thought that I would just give it a try and see how the clothes are. Um, I was really pleasantly surprised by this order. I liked basically everything that came in. Um, it's a pretty big order, so let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so in no particular order, the very first thing that I got is this striped bodycon dress right here. A very, very standard bodycon dress, um, a pretty thick material, which I was happy with, as well as adjustable straps. There's a lot of colors in here, actually. There's some brown, yellow, green, white, pink, which you can see when I get really close up here, but from afar, it just really looks like a neutral brown dress, which I like. I particularly, bought this dress to go with another item in this haul which is this black see-through uh, crop top right here i had seen another youtuber i think it was karina i'll go ahead and link her in the description box below because she gave me the inspiration for this combination but she got this dress with this black um top to go underneath which is like a kind of trendy thing that's going on right now so i wanted to try it myself um looks cute Personally, not my style. I don't think I would ever actually combine these two together, but I just wanted to try it out and it does fit. The next item that I picked up is this crochet crop top right here. As if I don't own enough crop tops, I got another one, uh, this time in white. What I really liked about this were the brown button detailing. Um, you don't actually necessarily have to wear this only on top of like a bathing suit or something like that. I feel like if you're wearing a bra that has some detail to it that you can kind of see through the top a little bit. I don't think that it looks bad necessarily. I actually think that it looks pretty cute. You can also wear a nude bra with this and it would kind of just blend in with your skin tone. So yeah, I was kind of thinking that this might be like a beach only. Uh, thing, but I actually just kind of wear it everywhere and you know, I mean I I think it looks fine I don't get any like dirty looks or anything like that. So I think we're okay Okay, the next item that I bought I am in love with I freaking love this skirt I loved this skirt when I first got it and then when I started wearing out wearing it out and getting compliments on it Like every single time I wore it then I fell in love with this skirt even more um, it's not necessarily summery, I'll say that. It's a very thick sort of woolish material, so it'll be definitely good for, I think, fall and winter as well. But it's just got all these sort of different um, knitting colors in it. So it's got like gray, white, black, and then I also love the fringe detail that it has on the bottom here. Um, very, very cute and on trend. The next item I got is another skirt. So I picked up this, um, I guess is this red, like an auburn um, red skirt right here. It's got an asymmetrical hem as well as a little tie in the front. I love the um, frilly detail there at the bottom. That's one of the main reasons why I bought the skirt. It's super cute with like a white top and maybe some wedges for the spring and summer. So yeah, just really happy with this skirt as well. Okay, moving on to a top. I got this super cute blue polka dot top right here. It's just really adorable. It's got a cute neckline, um, some frilly details for the shoulders as well as um, like a peplum situation going on in the stomach area. It's cropped, but it's not too cropped. Like you'll see on the try on portion, like with a high waisted, you know, a uh, pair of shorts or something like that. You're not showing too much skin, but also like just enough. Uh, yeah, I love this. It's adorable. Um, staying on the polka dot trend, uh, which actually I bought more polka dot in this haul than I had anticipated, but I also got this polka dot dress here. It's black and white. It um, has tieable shoulders, which is kind of interesting because you can sort of, I guess, depending on you know, how high or low you want the dress to go. You can adjust the um, the ties at the shoulders. The thing is though, is that they gave you a lot of fabric. So I feel like it's just a lot of fabric. I wanna be able to maybe cut some off, but if I cut it off, then I would have to like re-sew it, which I, your girl does not know how to sew. So I don't know, we might just have to live with it with the super long ties on the, on the shoulders. Um, but yeah, it's 
bodycon fitting. It's very, very flattering. And my favorite part about the dress is the whole mermaid um, uh, situation at the very bottom of the dress. That's just very different. I don't actually own anything like that. So yeah, happy with that. Um, I'm not sure when I would find an occasion to wear this, but once I do, it's going down. Okay, last item that's polka dot in this haul is this halter top. It's not a halter top. What is this? It's a tube top? Tube top um, polka dot. Again, that. Okay, so I've got this um, sort of auburnish red tube top right here with again an, a peplum situation here. Uh, it's a crop top. Um, it's got a tie in the middle with a little like sort of peephole situation going on I make sure that the tie covers the peephole because then otherwise you can see your bra But also you can not wear a bra But I have to wear a bra because it's a tube top and otherwise if I don't have a bra on it's just gonna like Slide down and then you know, it's, it's not gonna be appropriate for the public eye But yeah, still a very cute top. Okay, so something that is solid color now and now we're moving into some really bright shit I'm not gonna lie uh, starting with this Lime green crop top right here. I freaking love this. Whoa, it's making the color on my camera Turn a little crazy. So maybe I won't hold it up for that long. But yeah, it's super duper cute um, I've already worn it with like a pair of high-waisted shorts. I mean for the summer you can't really go wrong in this sort of highlighter neon trend is like super in right now so i thought i would just try it out with a crop top and yeah i really like it i was a little bit concerned because i have like a darker skin tone so i wasn't sure what that was gonna do for my skin tone but um i feel like you know if nothing else it accentuates it which is nice so yeah happy with that okay the next thing that i got is probably the only thing in this whole whole haul that i'm like kind of on the fence about and not sure if this is ever gonna actually get worn in real life i'm not gonna return it because it was cheap everything in this haul was like super cheap i think everything in this haul is probably less than 15 dollars so yeah gotta love shein for that you know sort of cheap price factor um but anyway it is this yellow um frilly sleeve top right here it's got a super stretchy um, elastic sort of bandeau for the um, body portion of it and then it's got these puffy puffy sleeves I can't wear it with the sleeves all the way up on my shoulder it just looks too like house on the prairie for me I don't know I'm struggling to find I've been looking for like the right yellow for my skin tone I just I haven't found it yet but I mean this it fits me it's just not like the most flattering thing ever okay last two things um, well clothing wise I do have some accessories as well I got this tie-dye shirt right here, um, just super casual, it's tie-dye, it's got this like makeshift knot here at the front which I thought gave it a little something something, um, yeah, I just this is giving me like Fresh Prince of Bel-Air vibes and I love it. Okay, last clothing item and then we'll move on to a couple of accessories. I got this um, sort of, what is this, like watercolor shirt right here and like this really bright reddish pink hue as well as white and it's got a little cute planet there on the side again just another really cute casual top that i could wear with like high-waisted shorts basically every single top that i showed i mean they're all crop tops i would wear with like a pair of high-waisted shorts okay i got three accessories i'm gonna start with um the least practical and work my way to the most practical of these so this first one i literally bought just because just just for the gram, y'all, I got one of these like see-through bags with the little pouch inside and the wooden handles. I mean, this thing is cute. I, I, I like it, but outside of taking pictures with it, there's no way I'm gonna wear this bag out. Like I just, I feel like, I feel I have no practical use for this bag, but it is cute. The second item, I thought I might actually use it. I, I mean, I love a good fanny pack. It's a snake skin fanny pack. This is another purchase that was inspired by Karina's video. And um, it's really cute, but I think it's too big for my body. Like putting this on my actual body, it just doesn't, it doesn't look the same on me as it does on her. So <laughs> that didn't really work out. But I mean, again, this was cheap. So honestly, I mean, whatever. 
The last bag is the most practical and I can actually use this bag. It's a straw bag, very, very trendy, but also, I mean, you can use this, it's hard. You know, you can put your iPhone in here, you don't have to worry about it getting squished or anything like that. It's got a nice, comfortable brown strap on it. And yeah, this one I really like, good for pictures, but you can actually use it, so that's nice. Okay guys, that is everything for today's Shein haul. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you got some inspiration and you know, hopefully you found some items that you liked and that you wanna purchase as well. Um, leave your comments in the description box down below. I'm on this like Shein kick right now. So if there's actually anything on, anything on the site that maybe you're thinking about buying, um, but don't know how well it's gonna fit, maybe you can just leave it in the description box down below and maybe I'll buy it and show it to you. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Okay guys, I'll see you in my next one. Bye.